Let's talk about the trucker caravan. Essentially what's happened is that both Canada and the United States have made a requirement for truck drivers. I filmed that video almost one year today. That video came out on the 25th of January. The convoy left on the 23rd. I think it's important for us to revisit what the convoy means because in that video, before they even got to Ottawa, I basically called out exactly what was going to happen. I called it like it was. And I mean, truthfully though, even I couldn't have imagined that they were going to cause over six billion dollars in damages to our economy. But we have now seen Pierre Paul Lievre doubling down on the pathos of the Freedom Convoy. He has been using misogynistic hashtags. He has been defending white supremacists. And he's been doubling down on people like Jordan Peterson, which is a super weird thing. Just wait until he defends Andrew Tate. I'm sure it's coming eventually. You know, free speech, the Matrix, all that good stuff. But on top of that, on top of that, we have also seen Pierre Paul Lievre speak at events where uh, the people who organize the events deny Indigenous genocide. And the fact that we did anything to harm indigenous people. He has been really doubling down and rooting himself in the anger and the hatred that has existed because of the freedom conflict. And the reason that it's important to, to talk about that is because it's important to not let ourselves fall to that anger and that hate. And I understand that there's going to be people who are going to do it anyway. But for the rest of us, for the average person, don't become the hateful version of the inverse of what they are. We have to believe in Canada, we have to maintain a positive disposition, and we have to do everything in our power in order to maintain this country in the amazing, like, I'm saying this wrong, I'm trying to do this in one take and I'm sorry, but we need to keep fighting, that's it. <laughs> like, I don't know how else to say it. I don't do these long single take one form videos because I usually like to make sure that the, that the minutia of my words is, is carefully calculated and curated, but it's just, that's how it is. We need to fight. We need to be here for each other and we need to make sure that 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 we saw in Ottawa doesn't take over our political discourse. And it's easy to be angry and it's easy to just yell and point and scream and say bad, 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 but we need to go beyond that. And so I'm trying my best in 2023. Let's do better. Let's be better.